Yeah, hello everybody, and welcome back to Fujit Blitz with me, Fujit. Hello. Burning games. Oh, I love burning games. I'm a big fan of burning games and I'm a big fan of it rising. I'm not too keen on mad games, but I really like burning games. And there are some tanks in burning games, which I'm going to show you this one. This is the Yag 88. Now, this is the Snow Tiger version, but it's the same, same as the one that my Tomb Mate is in. Just a different name and different camo. That is truly broken in Burning Games. It really is broken. Why do I say that? Well, it's got insane DPM. Absolutely insane. And it's got trolley armor. It's got pretty decent mobility for a TD. But... It's insane DPM. That really counts. Now, I don't do a shed load of damage in this game, but I do a shed load of kills. And that's why I love this tank. I mean, I really do think this is pretty OP for a tank in Burning Games. Now, you could roll out on the Annihilator or the Smasher or any of those alleged broken OP tanks. But no, this, for me, is the real deal. I mean, if you really want to roll out in a truly OP tank in this game mode, then you're not going to go wrong with the Jag 88. Not only that, it's a premium tank, which means you can get some decent creditos with it, and that's never a bad thing. And, you know, I've had so much fun playing a lot of the TDs, actually, mainly the German TDs in, in Burning Games, including the Scorpion G, the Ferdinand and the Jag Panther 2. But it's this one that really does it for me. Because, as I said, I mean, that, look at this DPM. I mean, it's just absolutely rock solid. And, you know, your mobility is pretty good. I mean, what is so bad about this tank? Where is the bad side to it? Penetration, check, really good. Armor, check, really good. DPM, check, really good. I mean, it is just a fantastic tank. You can play it aggressively. Okay, I'm going to get wrecked here by the IS-5, but hey, I don't care. You can play it aggressively, and you can really rack up some kills in damage. I mean, I've already done six kills here. I've only done 3k damage, mainly because my two mates steal all that damage while I steal all the kills. Now, the thing about burning games, if you are in a clan and you are aiming to try and get that 50 TP, okay, you can't get Brothers in Arms medals, but you know what? You can do almost every, you can do all your missions in burning games. And what better way to do it? Do it in a bit of style. Get into your YAG 88 and get your backsides out there because seriously, you really can't go much wrong with this tank. I'm, I'm being serious, guys. It will do a lot of damage, take a lot of kills, and it really is a fantastic tank to play in this game mode. Now, I'll be honest with you, it's very, very rare for me to say that a tank is broken or OP. But when it comes to the different game modes, well, it's a different kettle of fish, different parameters apply. And for this game mode, Burning Games, seriously, I think the Yag 88 is totally, totally broken for this game mode. I mean, look at me on this VK168. He's going to push me. I'm just going to load the APCR premium ammunition and I'm just going to sit here and I've already bounced him for 600 and I'm just going to keep whittling him down, whittling him down, whittling him down and eventually he's out of the game. Now I'm going to turn around and put one shot into the SDA and ta-da then. <laughs> so I've already taken a kill. I've already dished out 2,000 damage. Um, there's another kill. And this is what you can do with this tank you can be aggressive you can get up close and personal you can front line it and you can have a great time while doing so the reason i didn't heal the kv there is because i've got my super duper um penetrating massive damage shot and then i fluff it on the t28 because i track him that didn't help so i could have uh oh well it happens but i get another shot in but I'm still alive. <laughs> I'm still front lining this damn thing. And that is why I think it's broken. Because I just think it's spectacular. If you have got one of these tanks in your garage and you haven't played it for a while, dust it off and roll it out in burning games. Because seriously, I think this tank is just 
spectacular for this game mode. It was built for this game mode, I think. And I, I just had great fun in it. Earned a lot of credits, finished all my clan missions, all in one tank. <laughs> Beautiful, man. And that's what you should be looking at doing, guys. Having a bit of fun. Rolling out in tanks that, you know, is, is going to increase your chances of doing well. And this is one of them. And, you know, okay, we died there, but hey. This tank's still got a lot in it. I'm going to chase down the STA, but uh, I'm not going to get there in time, I don't think. Uh, I think somebody else is going to kill him. So, but not a problem, because there's lots of people on the sea cap. And we've already capped, so we're going to win on points anyway. But that's not uh, what I'm after here. I want damage, because I want credits. Um, and I always see we've got the T28 and we've got the Yo there. So let's roll up, put some shots into the Yo. Okay, mobility on the hill on this thing is not great, but you know what? I don't care. Because look at this DPM. <laughs> it's absolutely amazing. Loving it. Anyway, that has been my choice for the most broken tank, most OP tank for burning games. If you've got it, get out of it. I've been food it. That has been the Jag 88 in burning games. By all means, comment in everything below. And until the next time, guys, remember, get yourself out into burning games, get those clan missions done and those ingots. Maybe the 50 TP will make its way into your garage. And until the next time, stay safe out there, have fun on the battlefield, and happy tanking, because that is what it's all about, having fun and being happy.